very base level to protect the instrument. You're just gonna wanna get a microfiber cloth and you can get massive packs of these for very cheap uh, online or in, in a lot of grocery stores they have them in the US and I'm sure Europe. And this is the type of cloth that has the small fibers on one side and the shorter small fibers on the other side. I prefer these over other ones because they don't get stuck to anything and they tend to really wipe down well. But if you were really stuck, you could use a towel, you could use something else like that, but you wanna use something that's not gonna scratch any of the finish or the coating on your instrument. After that, you need to find some type of an oil. Now, I tend to like a coconut oil mixture, and I usually make this mixture myself. There's also tons of hand pan oils that you can use as well, but what's important is you're going to want a, an oil without a petroleum base. Um, Vaseline could be used, but it can interact with some coatings on some generations. So the easiest thing to do is use coconut oil, refined coconut oil. Uh, and that's very cheap to get around here. I'm sure you could use other types of oil. Um, I've used Frog Lube CLP, there's tons of handpan oils, but in general, coconut oil warmed up a little bit is going to give you the best result. This particular one is a coconut based handpan oil that my, one of my friends makes, but I would definitely recommend using a small amount, and you can apply it directly to the instrument. If you're using the coconut oil and it's hard, you'd rub it between the pieces on the cloth for a little bit until it dissolves into it. Or if you have one that's a little more pourable, like this brand, you could put it a little bit, little dabs on it like that. Not a lot, you wanna use less than you think, and then take your microfiber cloth and wipe around the instrument, making sure you distribute the oil everywhere. Where this is hydrophobic, this is kind of an extra step that you don't really have to do at super frequently, but I still recommend doing it because you never know um, if you got any of your salt or sweat on there. So I recommend wiping this maybe at least once a week. Um, you could do it twice a week if you're really playing it a lot or in a salty environment. 